Hello listeners. Welcome back to Speak Hack, your inspiring channel. Today we'll be going through life story of a thin guy who has been showing a great power in cricket. Success is no accident. It is hard work, perseverance, learning, studying, and sacrifice and most of all. Similarly, Indian all-rounder Hardik Pandya's recent success is also a result of his constant efforts to achieve what he always wanted to. He was born on the 11th of October 1993 in Surat city, Gujarat. His family includes his father, Kimanza Pandya, his mother, Nalini Pandya and his brother Krunal Pandya, who is also a cricketer. At present, he may appear to be a party guy if you go by his mere looks and appearance. His lavish lifestyle, consistent presence on social media, swag, and style does give that kind of an impression. However, those who are aware of his backstory, know how grounded a person he is. He says that his brother and he used to get Maggie for 5 rupees and they used to request the gardener to give them hot water and they used to prepare and eat it at the ground for lunch and breakfast. 365 days non-stop. Failed in 9th standard. During his school days, Hardik could not clear the exams of 9th standard and later left studies to focus only on cricket. IPL changes everything in his life. Things changed when the Mumbai Indians bought him for 10 lakhs in the IPL 2015 auction. The sum of money became much bigger. Their condition changed and family became stable. His hard work had finally paid off. People started seeing the potential in him to represent India at the international stage as an all-rounder. The wait seemed finally over. No one knew who Hardik Pandya was before 2015 IPL. He got picked for 10 lakhs. If people knew him he would have got a lot more money, not that it's only about the money. He was from a struggling family. Well, they had a good family and then things changed, father's health and all had a grave effect. That helped them. Where they are standing now is because of that situation. As per media reports, it is said that Hardik's family's financial condition was never good till he made his entry into IPL in 2015 for Mumbai Indians. His family shifted from Zurat to Baroda just for the sake of Hardik and his brother Krunal's cricket training. Pandya was not the only one who worked hard and made sacrifices. His parents did their best to give their children the best opportunities to make a name for themselves. His father had a small car finance business. Free coaching for Hardik. Former Indian cricketer Ear and Moore did not charge any fee from Hardik and his brother Krunal for first three years in his cricket academy in Baroda. Hardik borrowed bats from Irfan Patan. During his starting days in domestic cricket, Hardik did not have any bat to play in the Vijay Hazza Air Trophy of 2014 but thanks to Irfan Patan who gave him his bats after he called on to the left arm pacer for help. All the hardships seem worth it now. Pandya has come along a long way now after a lot of struggle. He still remembers those days, those hardships that he went through. He says when they came to play in Mumbai during under 19 days, they used to take photographs with Trident Hotel as backdrop. Later now he stayed there. His lifestyle has changed but probably he hasn't changed from within. Everything that he suffered might seem to be worth the success to him now. And yes. He still loves Maggie. And he still eats it. Do you know Hardik was a leg spinner? Initially, Hardik used to bowl leg spin but later he turned towards medium pace and credit of the same goes to ear and more. Few years back. In the local tournament in villages of Gujarat, Hardik used to get paid 400 rupees to play for any team. He revealed this story in an interview with ESPN Crick Info and said, there was no name for the tournament. It was just between villages. His brother used to get 500 rupees. Hardik got pracings from Ricky Pointing, Tendulkar and John Wright for his best. He gives a lot of credit for his success to Rahul Dravid. 
he instilled the belief in Pandya that he can be a real match winner for India. IPL Debut of Pandya Hardik made his IPL debut for Mumbai Indians against Royal Challengers Bangalore, where he scored an impactful 16 runs from six balls, which included two sixes. He bowled three overs as well but was quite expensive as he conceded 37 runs and went wicketless. He is among the rare seam bowling all-rounders in current Indian circuit. Hardik is known for his aggression and confident nature, be it in his batting or bowling. He is considered to be India's future all-rounder in limited overs cricket and has made his name quite early in his career. He listened to people and want to do anything and everything for cricket. Here an example. Hardik played a match-winning knock against CSK in IPL 2015 by scoring 21 runs from just 8 balls, which included 3 sixes. Before the match, Hardik did not want to play because of the catch in his neck but thanks to trainer Paul Chapman, who motivated him to play and asked him to be on the field after having some painkillers. Till first 10 overs of the match, Hardik was unable to move his neck properly and had taken five painkillers. Later, after the match, Hardik hugged Chapman and calls that match as the turning point of his career. Another great performance. During a Group C match against Delhi in Mush to a Kali Trophy of 2016, Hardik smashed a scintillating 81 off just 51 balls and during this course, he made headlines because of scoring 39 runs in an over. Let's have a look at his achievements. At the age of 22, he made his 2020 international debut against Australia. Man of the match in his one-day international debut. Top scorer in 2016 Mush to a Cali T20 tournament with 377 runs. Fastest ever half century in ICC Champions Trophy final. That's the inspiring story of Hardhik Pandya. Let's wish him more success. Thank you.